How's it going guys? Welcome back. Um, as some of you might know, for those that were watching last night, you might have heard me mention about having someone on again in the studio area wanting to talk to me. Well, I don't normally do this kind of video. A talking head's not me. It's not what I normally do. But on this occasion, I really do think this needs to be addressed. A lot of information was sent my way, a hell of a lot of information, regarding another YouTuber. So this is basically everything that's been sent to me. Now I'm not saying that this person has done what they've done, I'm not being the one to accuse him. I'm simply putting this content out there so you, the viewers, can make your own mind up. You can choose to carry on following him. You can choose to carry on following me. You can choose to leave should you wish. But one thing I've always said is I'm a man of, the, of my word and I don't believe that this kind of shite should be going on on YouTube anymore. I for one am sick to the back teeth of it. Totally am. Um, there are several conversations some between myself and the person that's provided this information and some between myself and Gary Webb from Pond and Garden. Later on, I'm going to be putting up all the information that I've been sent, all the footage that has been sent through to me, which shows from the person who sent the info, Gary Webb was instructing him to do this kind of thing. To tear down my channel, to lose my subscribers, to ruin my live shows, to run me off of YouTube. Sad. Sad state of affairs when it comes to it that another YouTuber thinks it's acceptable for doing this, or to do this. I contacted Gary last night and invited him into a Discord chat with the intentions of showing him everything that was being said and the things that people were accusing him of doing. To which he decided to flip and lose his shit as many people have witnessed and seen in the past. We've all, at some point, well not all, but a lot of us have been at the back end of a tongue lashing from Gary Webb. I for one, I've had it several times, but not no fucking more. I'm going to put up the video, put up the content, and then you guys out there can make your own mind up and decide what you think has been said, whether it be true or not. That's not me saying it is. That's for you to judge for yourselves. So, I'll get back to you after this.
he's paid me money. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's paid me a lot of money, Gaz. Oh, yeah, he's paid me a lot of money. Like it's improved. Gaz, knock him off. He's a fucking twat. I'm not interested. I'm not coming back on. So whatever damage he and you guys think you can do to me, go ahead and do it. So I'm not interested. Would you like to see my bank statements as well? To prove that no money has transferred hands. Well, yeah, grooming, grooming. Let him go and claim what he wants. Grooming. Trust me, tell him from me, guys, he does not want to take me on. Now, I'm not interested. If I was you, guys, and I mean this seriously as a friend, cut yourself off from the fucking twat now. And Kaz just came up with a good point. If I was grooming him, would not I be paying him money? And we're not interested in getting involved in all this troll shit. No, and we're not involved in getting on in all this shit. Not interested at all. So if you want to go to the police, go to the police. If he wants to go to the police, go to the police. Bad day when someone takes me on in that sense. I'm going to make this very fucking clear. You guys asked me for specific proof. You were shown that proof. You dare to call me a fucking liar. Just what the you, trolls want. Just what, yeah, just what the trolls want. You want to start a war, guys? Start a war. Because I'll fucking assure you, you're about to lose big time. All of you. Now, the main reason why I'm doing this is for all the other YouTubers that have been subject to this little charade that's been going on. For example, James the Coy Whisperer, the Balding Reefer, Keeping It Coy, um, Coy Beginnings, DT Coy, Vince, ANC Coy, just to name a few. There has been so many cloned Skeggy, obviously Skeggy. Skeggy has had more than his fair share of shit. And I think that the footages that you've seen shows the links from Gary Webb or the person who was forwarded with me the information, Gary Webb telling him to go to his business account and make false statements and false claims and false accounts and leaving shitty comments on his business. Now, it's one thing to mess about with somebody on YouTube, but another thing to start pissing about with a man's livelihood. That, I personally think, is fucking disgusting. A man's got children to feed, a house to run and bills to pay, same as us all. That's not me sticking up for Skeggy in no shape or form. That's me just pointing out what I consider a real low cheap move. I'd like to think that all the people that have been affected by this will watch this and think that at least somebody at some point now has actually done something to show what could be the possible reason behind it. And that is, in my eyes, Gary Webb from Pond and Garden. Now, I don't know if Kaz was behind it or knew anything about it at all. They both claim their innocence. They both claim it's not to do with them. But one thing that surprised me more than anything is the little statements that they've put out online about shutting down their site, temporary postponing everything from now, but all the content is gone. Now, what's that? if not an admission of guilt. If you were innocent and if you'd done something and you had or you hadn't done something, you'd stand your corner and you'd probably put out a video to say, this weren't us, we'll get this sorted, we'll work our way through it, but no. Instead, he chose to do on what you've heard and seen, rant and rave, threatening and abuse, Aggressive behaviour over, over text, over voice messages, as he always does. Well, on this occasion, mate, 
I got you a bank to rights and I stuck it all on the internet. Hopefully, this time, it shows you for your true colours. Usual thing, guys. If you're enjoying this kind of content, like, share, subscribe, tell a friend. Until next time, keep smiling. I say you're going to stop me, mate. I'm going to continue doing what I'm doing. And I'm going to continue smiling. I'll see you all soon. Catch you on the next one, guys. Take it easy.